Winter Outfits 2022. Day to evening outfit ideas. Style tips. So let's start by stating the obvious. December can feel very hectic. We're often still working, trying to buy Christmas presents, make the house look festive, dashing to the children's school plays, and with the endless festive parties thrown into the mix, it can feel overwhelming constantly trying to find something to wear. But fear not, today's video shall hopefully give you all the outfit ideas and style tips you need to go from day to evening in style, whatever the dress code. A portion of today's video has very kindly been sponsored by Miss 60. They've kindly sent me some very chic day and evening looks that I am super excited to share with you all a little bit later in this video. But first, let's get started with these winter outfits. Chic and stylish workwear outfits number one. Desk to dinner outfit ideas often fill people with dread, but it's all about having the right essentials in your back pocket that you can easily reach for. So let's start with the office look. I would probably go for a combination a bit like this. One beautiful pair of tailored trousers that nip and tuck in all the right places. Now, some of you might remember that I tried on these well-loved Me and M trousers in the summer fabric. I fell in love with them, and now I am very happy to have finally got the winter version new in my own wardrobe. How stunning are these trousers? I absolutely love them. The winter 2022 version is made from an Italian flannel fabric with just a smidgen of elastin. The high waist feels incredibly flattering, and I like that it's got that adjustable waist at the back, which is just helping to cinch me in a little bit more. Now, I sized down in these as I remembered from the summer that they came up a tiny bit big, but the length works perfectly whether I style them with flats or perhaps going for a low heel. So this is a pretty classic, effortless, and hopefully you agree, stylish workwear look. But let me now show you how you could very easily switch that from a daytime outfit for the obligatory office party in the evening. The day to night workwear switch. Now this would be my perfect evening outfit, not just for office parties, but for just about everything. And as you can see, all I've actually changed is my top and my shoes, which is something you could easily switch out at the office. I feel so very elegant in this top. That midnight blue is so incredibly stunning, it's really rich tone, and it feels even more elevated because of that velvety texture. The bow ties at the neck, which just adds a little bit more drama, and yet it's all done so effortlessly because of the nature of the style and that tone that they've used. Now you could also leave that bow more loose and hanging if you prefer, which I like equally well, or simply drape it down your back even if you're after a bit of a minimal chic kind of look. Work events can be tricky to style, I know. You still want to feel chic and elevated, but still with an air of professionalism about your look. So this very timeless, yet oh so very elegant style feels like it strikes the right balance. Style tip. While it does seem a shame to hide this outfit idea underneath a coat, practicality-wise for the freezing temperatures, I'd either get to said event using the blazer that I had on in the daytime, but I would layer it over my shoulders instead. Or perhaps a long draping wool coat would work nice too. Doing something as simple as just wearing it on your shoulders can make a big difference to the overall effect of your outfit idea. Personally though, I'd be getting that coat or blazer off as soon as possible so I could really let this top be the star of the show. Christmas lunch with friends, daytime. This, of course, is one of the most fun events to get dressed up for, but it's daytime, you're literally in your lunch break, and you don't really want to go out looking like the fairy on top of the Christmas tree, but you still want to feel like you've made a bit of an effort. So what do you wear? I think December is the one time you could absolutely get away with a little sparkly number in the office. It brightens everyone's spirits, and you can still make this outfit feel professional too. So here I've paired mine with a classic turtleneck jumper, tights to keep me warm, Warm, but also to make that line of my body lengthened all the way down, and a blazer to make it feel even more workwear appropriate. Now, I personally love sequin skirts at Christmas time. Pair it with heels or even trainers, which you might have seen over on my Instagram page. They're far more versatile than you might first think, and obviously, there's no denying they add a little festive sparkle for this time of year. 
Lunch with friends, the out out look. Now to be honest, I would happily wear the same outfit, maybe minus the blazer, to meet my friends for lunch. But let's say you want to feel a little bit more dressed up, but with as little fuss as possible. I would just layer a simple camisole underneath that turtleneck that you could easily peel down to for lunchtime. Showing that little bit of extra skin makes the outfit feel a bit more dressed up. Plus there's more of a relaxed, carefree kind of vibe about it. With or without the blazer, it's personal preference really. And depending on how how hardy you're feeling against the cold, you could add or keep the tights. I think it works both ways, to be honest. But the key to these looks really is all about having the right sequin skirt in your wardrobe in the first place. One that you can easily mix and match with pretty easily from day to night. Style tip. While I love sequin skirts, they do have a tendency to catch on your tights and can snag them. With these outfit ideas, I would always carry a couple of spare pairs of tights in my handbag just in case. So as I mentioned earlier, Miss 60 got in touch and asked if I would like to try out some of their iconic denim jeans, which is always a favorite for me, whether I'm going casual or perhaps a bit more dressed up for the evening with a nice top. Now, if you're not familiar with Miss 60, they are an Italian denim fashion brand that began over 30 years ago, and they've continued to be one of the leading names in high quality denim ever since. So I have three fits to share with you. Firstly, I've opted for the bootcut jean, one fashion trend that we've seen a resurgence of this 2022 and one trend that I believe will be sticking around for 2023 as well. I've gone true to size for my usual 28 and I love the fit with that regular waist. In fact these are just reminding me why I lived in bootcut jeans the first time around. They're just so very flattering. It's actually quite hard not to feel a little bit taller and lengthened when wearing a great pair of bootcut jeans and both from a silhouette and quality point of view these ones are absolutely gorgeous. Now as you've seen throughout this footage I would either wear them dressed down and casual for everyday chic or a little more elevated with winter whites with a beautiful fringed blazer. Now this one actually comes with a detachable chain if you're looking for that extra sprinkle of festive sparkle. So the second style of jeans I have feel amazing to wear as the denim is quite incredibly embedded with cashmere. I didn't even know that was possible. On top of the denim having an element of cashmere they're also lined with fleece. So not only do I love the lifting effect of this particular pair of jeans but the feel against my skin and the added thermal layer for winter cannot be underestimated. I personally fall in and out of love with skinny jeans but it's a style I will always have in some shape or form in my wardrobe. Again they dress up or down depending on the occasion but the beauty of these for me really has to be that luxurious fabric composition which will no doubt be an absolute game changer once the height of winter sets in. And last but by no means least are a pair of denim jeans made for the those who love a little bit of a high-waisted silhouette. But again, with a little bit of luxury sprinkled into the mix with that cashmere blend and fleece lining. I really wish you could feel what I feel through the camera because these are so incredibly soft to wear. Shape-wise, I love that triple belt detail across the waistband and I think it really helps draw the eye to that smallest part of my body, which is a great trick, of course, if you're wanting to avert attention from elsewhere. Everything can also be washed in the machine cold, so while they might feel Feel incredibly luxurious to wear, you don't need to be too precious with them either. Now if you spend over 350 euros this Christmas, you will also receive a limited edition waist chain to add a bit of sparkle to your winter outfit ideas. Miss 60 really are the creme de la creme when it comes to creating innovative denim designs, so I would really recommend you take a look at their full collection for yourself. As always, I have added a link for you in the description box below. Christmas Day. I do like to plan my Christmas and Boxing Day outfits. It's a little bit of a tradition that I have with myself and I actually really, really enjoy the process. It's a bit ridiculous really because inevitably I'm all dressed up and I spend half the day cooking and the other half of it I'm sat on the floor building Lego or some sort. But hey, whatever makes you happy. So this year we are very excited to have David's parents for Christmas Day, friends coming in the evening and my stepdad coming for Boxing Day. So it gives me the perfect perfect excuse to plan ahead what I'm going to wear. Christmas Day outfit. So let's start with Christmas Day and I've decided to go with a tonal look with just a hint of sparkle. The green feels very festive and it's been one of my favourite shades to wear this winter 2022 so I thought it was quite fitting that I wear it for Christmas Day. The key for me at Christmas is while I like to feel quite dressed up I don't want my outfit to feel too precious as I'm actually cooking and I don't want to feel cold or uncomfortable while I'm doing it. 
So it's a mixture of reasons really that I end up choosing outfits like this. Ultimately, it's about feeling dressed up in the most comfortable way possible. I've added my lovely jewelry into this look to give it a bit more of an evening feel. And I love that sprinkle of gold against the green too. Such a lovely combination. Christmas Day Party. Now with a simple switch out of that blouse before, you could easily have made that last look work for the evening too. But I'm going to throw caution to the winds this Christmas and actually wear a dress. And a mini one too. Shocker, I know. I rarely wear dresses and it's even rarer for me to wear anything short short. But hey, if you can't go a little bit extra on Christmas Day, then when can you? So this little sequin beauty is new in my wardrobe this December and surprisingly, I actually really like it. The label was off within about two minutes of trying it on. It is actually quite an A-line shape and you could leave it like that if you prefer, but I felt that I needed to have a bit more shape at my waistband, so I've cinched it in by using one of my tie belts that I've got. The perfect dress for a festive Christmas party, I think, even if it is for a bit of a kitchen disco with our friends. Boxing Day daytime look. Again, I need a day to night winter outfit, so I'd probably start out with something like this. Our Boxing Days are a little more casual than Christmas Day, yet I still want to feel like I've made an effort while obviously still feeling comfortable in my own home. So here, as you can see, creature of habit, I've gone back to trousers again. But by adding these heels underneath, I've made them feel more party than professional. But it doesn't feel overpowering, it's just subtly making a statement, which is very much my cup of tea. Boxing Day night. Then for the evening, all you really need to do is go for this look minus the cardigan and voila, day to night with minimal fuss indeed. Now, if you're heading out the door, I would just add in a clutch bag rather than a crossbody and maybe think about adding quite a glam looking coat like this faux fur one for an extra statement to your outfit idea. Now, if you're looking for extra comfort, you could always switch out those bottoms if you prefer for jeans instead. I am a fan of jeans and a nice top. And of course, it's a classic for a reason. It is incredibly comfortable comfy and always seems to work to be honest so I am of the opinion if it's not broke I'm not going to try and fix it. Keeping those same heels but this time they're more on show and really it's about letting that top half of me rather than the bottoms do all the talking. Family Christmas get together. For family gatherings, it's nice to get dressed up, but it's a different kind of outfit to what I might wear with my friends. And in all honesty, it really does depend which family members we're seeing, which helps me decide what to wear. So to see David's older family members, I'd probably go with something pretty classic and timeless like this. One of my favorite winter outfits of 2022 in truth, mainly because of that stunning winter coat that just completes any of my looks. I wouldn't worry about looking festive as such for family gatherings. I tend to prefer thinking about the tones and the textures that I'm adding into the mix. Just making sure that they feel luxurious in a winter wonderland kind of fashion. Style tip. This is when layering can really come in handy. Not just to be able to switch an outfit from day to night, but to really make those outfits feel more intentional and put together. Layering in as many different fabric compositions as possible really helps to make an outfit feel more luxe overall. So it's a style tip that I will often reach for. Now, before I say goodbye for the Christmas break, can I just say a huge thank you to all of you lovely women for all your support this past year. You are the loveliest collection of women all around the world who are so incredibly kind and supportive in your comments, and I really, really do appreciate it. It is really that that makes me want to create new content week after week. To hear that I've helped some of you get your style mojo back feels amazing. And I'm so grateful and proud of the really lovely community we've created on here together. Don't forget to take a look at that new collection from Miss 60. I've added a link to their new collection as well as that code if you fancy spoiling yourself too. I'm going to take a couple of weeks off filming my Sunday videos but will instead be posting my shorter outfit ideas and inspiration on YouTube shorts so do make sure you look out for those. And of course you can always see my daily outfit ideas and goings on behind the scenes over on Instagram. All that's left for me to say now is that I really hope you all have the most wonderful Christmas with with friends and family. Eat, drink and be merry and I shall see you in a couple of weeks. Big hugs everyone, take care.